Yo, what's up? It's me again. Vlog every damn day. <laughs> What's up YouTube? It's your homegirl Maria here again. So here's the thing. I don't know where Jeremy is. I don't know what happened to him. I don't know where he's at. Nobody knows where he is. He just disappeared. I don't know. So I am making this YouTube video because he is not here and someone gotta put up a YouTube video or it's just gonna go to hell and nobody wants that. So I did my makeup extra special today. I made it all look nice and I even put a little glitter dot on my face somewhere on here. I had a lot to drink earlier today. I'm coming from a party, Johnny Mayco, where my family is. So you know, all things up in the good hood, you know, bros and hoes and bitches. So we're just gonna make this video really, really short and really good. Cause you know, that's what we do up in here. So uh, this is commenting on comments or something, right? I don't know. I don't really watch his channel because I don't really like it. But you know, whatever. So uh, where is this computer thing? Okay. Claro. Let's let's just begin this. I got a headache, and you guys are not making it any better. You're talking so loud. Shut up. Stop. You're not even looking at me. This is what Chewy does in bed. First comment, you stupid bitch, stop doing this. I'm getting really fucking sick of this shit. Stop it. Seriously, stop. Regina knows that she's a queen. I don't know who the fuck Regina is. I don't know why you're trying to spoil this whole fucking show for me. That's what I'm assuming is that you're trying to just ruin the whole thing for me and telling me things that I don't even know. I was gonna watch the show, but then you just fucking ruined it also I'm not gonna watch it anymore brother and I saw you working last night well you showed up at the mall okay if you see me working on the side of the street and you do not buy a tamale then you're just not supporting my business okay I gotta send my money back to my mama in Mexico and you're not giving me money I just don't know what to do with you so come buy tortillas and tamales and all that stuff next time you see Okay. Uh, what do you think about dating a guy who's still in the closet? I dated a guy once that was still in the closet. And let me tell you, I got a really nice ball out of it. I th th this was just a really, really nice thing that he gave me after he denied me sex for a whole entire year and then I found out why. So the real question you gotta ask yourself is, how deep in the closet are you willing to go for this dude? Cause like, is he like, in the front of the closet or is he like in last year's fall fashion closet because like if he's in last year's fall fashion closet then like you got like there's like nowhere to go with that so you gotta like figure out how hard you're willing to fuck him in the closet and if yeah if he's gonna come to you know with all that stuff so you know you gotta like figure all this shit out but uh, you know, uh, what are you planning on doing with him? After you get him out of the closet, you're gonna tell him about your family and your family is gonna know about him. And then you're gonna end a really nice extravagant ball gifts. And, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, so. Uh, so if you go to the dumpster trash place and give him cans, they give you money. Yeah, I really, really like doing this. You see, I like to collect bottles and I go and I get them from my friends. Cause there are all these stupid dumb hole bags who just leave all their bottles all over the place so I go and I get them out of people's cars and I get them out of the street and out the gutter and stuff and you make a lot of money doing that. Gets a real good profit when you're not selling tamales like I do every single night on the side of the road, you know? What asshole will break into someone's car and smoke and steal registration papers? You know, I don't know what kind of stupid fuckers do stuff like this shit. You know, you, they should take up hobbies like going and digging around in trash cans and getting bottles and recycling them, not going and stealing people's papers. You know, because if someone stole my papers, I would have to go right back to where I come from and I don't want to go back there. Give us the old weed bag. You are not taking my weed, bitch. I will shank you. Stop. Right now. What have you done to Jeremy Murderer? Technically, we don't know if he was murdered or if he's just gone. 
or what the f Love the killer glasses. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't wear glasses. I don't need glasses. I'm not that kind of person. I am not that glasses. No, I am not glasses. Let's see who you're jumping in bed with your 55 numbers. Why put numbers in your comments? You know, I plan on jumping in bed with as many people as I can at 55 and all those other numbers that you put down there. So, us. I'ma have lots and lots of sex, lots and lots of this, so stop it. And don't put numbers in your comments anymore, but not when I'm like this. Love, bite it, and remind me of Louis to tell me to run direct. One direction! You stupid. Why you put one direction in your comments? They stole from me. Do you not know this? Do you not respect me? You must not. I'm done with this stupid video. All you people taking. With this shit, I'm not gonna do it anymore. I'm just done. No, I'm not gonna take this money. It's done. Just done with this stupid video.